हेलो सर सर यस यस पेज नंबर सर वो 32 पे सर एक डाउट है सर पेज नंबर 32 पेज नंबर 32 यस सर ईबी क्या है सर वहां कैपिटल ईबी बैक ईएमएफ दिस इज बैक ईएमएफ आई विल एक्सप्लेन टू यू द कॉन्स्टिट्यूटिव इक्वेशंस फॉर अ परमानेंट मैग्नेट डीसी मोटर तो व्हाट हैपेंस इज व्हेन यू प्लेस uh when you place a uh conductor uh in a magnetic field and you pass a current through it okay it experiences a force resulting in the development of a torque in this particular case okay yes but because the conductor moves due to the application of this force uh a potential difference is experienced on uh, across the conductor okay depending upon its resistance and uh, things like that but that potential difference is depending on the velocity with which it moves okay so that is the back emf effect so you find that on the electrical side uh, uh, while you apply the voltage here you apply the voltage vt but this resulted in the motion of this rotor okay motion uh, in the uh, turning of this motor when it turns uh, the the armature windings they rotate within the magnetic field okay and because they rotate uh, in the magnetic field uh, the the electrical side experiences a emf a potential difference across these ends okay a potential drop is experienced across this that drop is the back emf okay if this angular velocity is more then more will be the back emf this principle is used in the electric tachometer so uh you are all uh, familiar with the tachometer its measure is used for measurement of angular velocity isn't it i i suppose all of you know about it so it makes the reverse uh, it makes application of the reverse principle of the dc motor okay so in this case it generate whatever uh, power is generated okay so you measure the back emf and Uh, you have um, it's proportional to the angular velocity so uh, this uh, e1 here is a back em anything else i hope this point is clear to you